Hey buddy and welcome. And I want to talk about uh, people with recurve bows. And if they're looking to gain a compound bow, but they don't want to go through the entire hassle of buying the entire re the compound bow. They like their riser and everything about their recurve bow, but they want to go with the compound bow ability. <clears throat> Since a lot of recurves have the design of the frontal like this, or such forth, I would think that you can easily modify your recurve bow into a full-blown compound bow. Easy. Just buy yourself some limbs uh, from a compound bow uh, trasher or such forth. It's like uh, selling part, parts and such forth for a compound bow. Find the limbs that look pretty much like that design where they go upwards and not just like this way and um, find some cam wheels that uh, are identical or a one cam design basically aisle wheel then power cam down there then get yourself a string that fits um, to the size length of those cams <clears throat> and basically put that all on and then you're probably wondering now is how am I going to get the three strings away from the middle string? Well, I would believe you can do that with a string decelerator or aka string stop. Um, I know most people are saying, well, you can't mount that because there's no back mount for recurves. Use a frontal dec de uh, string decelerator. And that basically hooks onto the stabilizer port comes off to the side, hook it to the side that you're not holding your arm with, and then put it that way. And all you do is basically like this bow, you just put your string like that. Instead of having your strings like this, on the same side, you just pull them, put them on that side, put a cable slide in that string decelerator when you're hooking it up, and then maybe yourself a... Uh, limb dampener system and then now you have two in one a cable slide and a string decelerator and there you go you made your recurve bow into a full blown compound bow now as for the risers I don't really see it much of an issue with it turning from a recurve a wooden recurve into a wooden compound bow considering that it's wooden bows can hold a hundred pounds of pull from a recurve bow or long bow or such forth. So I wouldn't think that having a aluminum riser would be required because if these bows can hold a hundred pounds and be like fired, then having a sixty pound or six seventy pound compound bow on a wooden riser wouldn't really do much of an issue. <laughs> But yeah, just thought I'd mention that out for you guys that are probably interested in making your cool recurve riser into a full-blown compound riser. How neat would that be? Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and uh, peace out. Comment below what you guys think about that, and tell me if you ever tried that ability. Peace.